The giveaway for the Infinity Gauntlet will be ending in the next few days, so to enter all you have to do is like this video, subscribe, turn on notifications for the channel, and tell me below what your favorite Marvel movie is. We've known for some time that the Soul Stone, out of all of the Infinity Stones, is perhaps the most powerful and dangerous. As Red Skull explains in Infinity War, it has a certain place among all of the other stones. Based on the comic books, we also know that by far it's one of the most sinister of the six stones. Today though, we have evidence that the Soul Stone may be killed killing Thanos, or perhaps transforming him in some way. This isn't something that is happening immediately in Infinity War, but it is something that will definitely play a role in Avengers 4, as long as Thanos has the Soul Stone for long enough. As we saw in Infinity War, the Soul Stone has definitely taken its effect on Red Skull, but exactly what has happened is unknown. In the book though, we get some hint at this, as it says this, We wanted to play with the idea of what the Soul Stone has done to Red Skull, and whether he is a ghost-like being now or something completely soulless. It is even later hinted at that the Soul Stone being on Vormir is exactly why the planet is void of life. The Soul Stone, similar to the other Infinity Stones, is capable of corrupting a host, but to a much larger degree. As we saw with Red Skull, it actually physically transforms them into something less than they were before, something soulless. The Soul Stone even granted Red Skull unknown powers, the powers to know exactly whoever entered the planet of Vormir. But more than this, it restricted Red Skull so that he could never leave the planet at all. But this leads us to Thanos. Of course, now he is the new wielder of the Soul Stone. This could play a huge role as being in close proximity to the stone for so long for Red Skull resulted in some type of chain. We also know that there is a time skip in Avengers 4, which means for some time the Soul Stone has been able to work on its new master Thanos. It will definitely be interesting to see what effect the stones have had on Thanos, not just the Soul Stone, but the Soul Stone in particular. We do know now, it officially changes whoever is around it and whoever wields it. But again, I would love to hear your thoughts on this in the comments down below, and what do you think the Soul Stone has done to Thanos, if anything? Again, don't forget to enter the giveaway for the Infinity Gauntlet, subscribe to join the team, and have a great day.